Hi everybody, Raymond Francis. Let's talk about the newest disaster with GMO foods, GMO apples. GMO foods are controversial, but the, the establishment defends them. But my reading of the scientific literature indicates they are dangerous and they should be taken off the market. Unfortunately, we now have another GMO food on the market, apples. It's already not safe to eat corn or soy in the United States, and now we've got apples coming down. The so-called Arctic apple has been engineered to never brown, no matter how old or rotten it is. The problem with GMO foods is this, risk. They use a technology that many scientists think can have huge, unintended, negative consequences for our health and for the environment. Animal studies from around the world have shown that GMO crops can be extremely dangerous, causing damage to the liver, the heart, the lungs, the kidneys, the adrenal glands, the intestines, the spleen, the pancreas, that's a lot of damage. They shorten life and promote massive tumors. GMO soy and corn are fed to test animals. They produce stomach inflammation, a thinning of the intestinal walls, hemorrhaging, higher rates of miscarriages, you know, based on the existing science, GMO foods should at least require a label and at very best be completely removed from the market. About 75% of the processed foods in the supermarket contain GMO ingredients. Yet more than 70% of the American population says they don't want GMO food. In addition, almost all corn and soy now and papayas imported from Hawaii uh, and sugar beets and canola and zucchini and summer squash, these are all GMO crops now. So the buyer beware, we've just added another one, these apples. So uh, you know, I don't eat them, I recommend you don't eat them, we really need to take them off the market. Thanks a lot for listening, be healthy.